Mr. Obanisi, welcome to Tokyo. I would like to offer my sincere congratulations. え、昨年来、え、ま、え、昨年9月の、ま、会合以降、我々が、ま、重視する、え、法の支配に基づく国際秩序を根底から揺るがす事態が起きました。Since we met last September, Russian invasion into Ukraine squarely challenges the principles which are enshrined in the United。We should never ever allow a similar incident。私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私は、私
as they work to address it, including with new finance. We will act in recognition that climate change is the main economic and security challenge for the island countries of the Pacific. Under my government, Australia will set a new target to reduce emissions by 43 per cent by 2030, putting us on track for net zero by 2050. We have had a change of government in Australia, but Australia's commitment to the Quad has not changed and will not change, and our commitment to ASEAN and its centrality has not changed. My government has already committed to a greater focus on Southeast Asia, including the appointment of a special envoy for the region and $470 million in additional foreign aid over the next four years. This is in addition to our increasing assistance to the Pacific by over half a billion dollars, deepening our defence and maritime cooperation and using the power of proximity to strengthen our partnerships. We will bring more energy and more resources to securing our region as we enter a new and more complex phase in the Pacific's strategic environment. And we will continue to stand with you, our like-minded friends. And collectively, we will continue to stand up for each other. We will stand firm on our values and our beliefs, on what we know will enhance the stability and prosperity of our region and what is firmly in the interests of all those who call the Indo-Pacific home. I'm honoured to be among such close friends of Australia, to take these next steps with you, to pursue positive and practical ways to support a free, open and resilient Indo-Pacific. I look forward to strengthening our Quad partnership, starting with a productive meeting today. And I'm delighted to hand over to Prime Minister Modi. はい、あのアル,アルバニージー首相ありがとうございました。じゃ次はモディ首相よろしくお願いします。Your Excellencies、プラダムドリキシダン、プラダムドリアントニーアルバニージー、アルラスプディバイデン。प्रधानमंत्री की श्रद्धा आपके शानदार आतिथ्य के लिए आपका बहुत बहुत धन्यवाद आज टोक्यो में मित्रों के बीच होना मेरे लिए बहुत खुशी की बात है मैं सबसे पहले प्रधानमंत्री एंथनी अनमरे जी चुनावों में विजय के लिए आपको बहुत बहुत बधाई बहुत बहुत शुभकामनाएं शपथ लेने के 24 घंटे के बाद ही आपका हमारे बीच होना कौर मित्रता की ताकत और इसके प्रति आपकी प्रतिबद्धता को दिखाता है एक्सलेंसीज इतने कम समय में कौर समूह ने विश्व पटल पर एक महत्वपूर्ण स्थान बना लिया है आज कौर का स्कोप व्यापक हो गया है और स्वरूप प्रभावी हो गया है हमारा आपसी विश्वास हमारा डिटर्मिनेशन लोकतांत्रिक शक्तियों को नई ऊर्जा और उत्साह दे रहा है क्वाड के स्तर पर हमारे आपसी सहयोग से एक फ्री ओपन और इंक्लूसिव इंडो पैसिफिक क्षेत्र को प्रोत्साहन मिल रहा है जो हम सभी का साझा उद्देश्य है कोविड 19 की विपरीत परिस्थितियों के बावजूद हमने वैक्सीन डिलीवरी क्लाइमेट एक्शन सप्लाई चेन रेजिलियंस डिजास्टर रिस्पांस और आर्थिक सहयोग जैसे कई क्षेत्रों में आपसी समन्वय बढ़ाया है इससे इंडो पैसिफिक में शांति समृद्धि और स्थिरता सुनिश्चित हो रही है क्वाड इंडो पैसिफिक क्षेत्र के लिए एक कंस्ट्रक्टिव एजेंडा लेकर चल रहा है इससे क्वाड की छवि एक फोर्स फॉर गुड के रूप में और भी सुदृढ़ होती जाएगी बहुत बहुत धन्यवाद
モディッシュありがとうございましたそれでは続いてバイデン大統領や上位よろしくお願いします It's wonderful to be together with friends and、uh, at this transformative moment in the world. And we are at a transformative moment. Prime Minister Kishida, I want to commend you for the extraordinary leadership that over the past few months that you've shown and for the gracious way in which you've hosted all of us. And Prime Minister Modi, it's wonderful to see you again in person. The,、uh, I thank you for your continuing commitment to making sure democracies deliver. Because that's what this is about democracies versus autocracies, and we have to make sure we deliver. Prime Minister Albanese,、uh, I welcome you to your first Quad meeting. Like I said,、uh, you got on a plane, you were sworn in, got on a plane, and I, if you fall asleep while you're here, it's okay. I, <laughs> because I don't know how you're doing it, but <laughs> it's really quite extraordinary. Just getting off the campaign trail as well. Congratulations on your election. As I told you when you won, I called you that、uh, we greatly appreciate your commitment of being here so soon after、uh, taking office. Quad leaders met for the first time just、uh, over one year ago. It seems longer, but to date, our partnership is central to achieving our goals uh, uh, and, uh, and critical for the foundation of our continuing cooperation, in my view. We already accomplished a great deal. As was referenced earlier, cooperating on COVID 19 response and health security, more to do to state the obvious, partnering on 5G and technology supply chains, technology standard setting, and launching our, our Quad Fellowship Program, which I think is going to make a difference, which we talked about earlier. At the same time, we're navigating a dark hour in our shared history. The、uh, Russian brutal and unprovoked war against Ukraine has triggered a humanitarian catastrophe, and innocent civilians have killed in the streets, and millions of refugees are internally displaced as well as exiled. And、uh, this is more than just a European issue, it's a global issue. The fact is that what, if you turn on the television, you'll see what Russia is doing now. It appears to me that Putin is just trying to extinguish a culture. He's not even aiming at military targets anymore. He's taking out every school, every church, every, every natural history museum, as if to try to obliterate the Ukrainian、uh, culture. And、uh, the world has to deal with it, and we are. The global food crisis is made worse by Russia's blocking Ukraine、uh, from exporting its millions of tons of grain. And also,、uh, as long as Russia continues the war, the United States will work with our partners、uh, to help lead a global response because it can affect all parts of the world. At the same time, the United States must and will be a strong, steady, and enduring partner in the Indo Pacific. We are, in the Indo -Pacific we, are, we are an Indo Pacific power. As once asked by, well, I won't go into it, but as once asked by the leader of China, Why I kept talking about being an Indo Pacific power. I said, because we are. We share the Pacific, one entire side of our country. And we have been deeply involved with all of you for a long time. As long as Russia continues this war, we're going to continue to be partners and lead a global response. And you know,、uh, we're Indo Pacific power, as I said, we're going to stand with you, our close democratic partners. And we're going to stand for the shared values that,、uh, and the shared vision we all have. You know, shortly before Russia launched its invasion, my administration published our Indo Pacific strategy to advance a free, open, connected, secure, and resilient Indo Pacific. Russia's assault on Ukraine only heightens the importance of those goals, the fundamental principles of international order, territorial integrity, and sovereignty. International law, human rights must always be defended, regardless of where they're violated in the world. So the Quad has a lot of work ahead of us. It's,、uh, the fact of the matter is that we have a lot of work to do, keeping this region peaceful and stable, tackling this pandemic and the next one, and addressing the climate crisis, as referenced by our new colleague, ensuring that technologies of the future are governed according to our values. Governed according to our values. But a short time, in a short time, we've shown the Quad isn't just a passing fad. 
We mean business. We're here to get things done for the region, and I'm proud of what we're building together, and I look forward to our vital partnership flourishing and for many years to come. Thank you, Mr. Prime Minister.